Mark, uh, Syracuse only had one yard of offense in the fourth quarter. Is that something you guys kind of embrace when the game's a little bit close that you guys can kind of keep things under wraps? Uh, yeah, we just keep our mentality of just uh, never quitting, never uh, stopping, uh, no matter the situation. Um, I'm actually proud of us today. We handled a lot of um, uh, we handled a lot of um, like situations where we like you know bad field position or anything like that, and uh, we just just kept it rolling. Uh, what a seem, uh, what Demar seemed to kind of break down on that a long touchdown pass that they had. Uh, just a missed assignment. Um, something we we knew uh, as soon as it happened uh, that um, we were going to clean up and that it wasn't going to happen again. Um, wasn't as clean as we liked it, but um, you know uh, we we came out with a win. So we'll correct it in practice, and uh, we'll do better next week. Come on, you guy next to Harris got the uh, interception. Has that been something you guys feel like you could uh, make a bigger impact on this year? Is, is taking the ball away, especially on some of those overthrows across the middle like that one was? Uh, yes, sir. Um, we do we do turnover drills every day in practice, you know. And uh, just being able to affect the game like that and getting the ball back to our offense, um, we, we just try to do that as much as we can. Um, I, tell, I tell Kenny every time they come off the field that we're going to get them the ball back. So we're trying to get a turnover every possession. Mar, as a fellow senior, I mean, how, how do you kind of, um, you know, assess or, or how happy I guess are you for Rashad Weaver and kind of the way that you know he came back finally, getting in and, and getting a couple sacks there? Oh uh, man, I love playing with Weave. Uh, just just having him out there, it's just like a different confidence, you know. Just having him out there, he's a he's a game changer, um, and, and and even more. Uh, so you know, just having him out there, he's just a force and a, a presence, and a, a just I, I can't wait to keep playing with him. Demar, how do you approach a, a, a week of practice coming up after your defense played well, the quarterback played well, but the game wasn't as, as smooth as you would like it to be? Um, well, like you said, uh, it wasn't as smooth as we'd like it to be. So we we see there's a lot of room for improvement, and um, we had a we had a, a mistake giving them a touchdown. Um, so the game could have been a lot cleaner. So I'm pretty sure, uh, me personally, I know I got a lot to work on, and I know. The way the mentality is with the guys, uh, they all know that there's there's more to work on. Um, it's another game, so it's another week to get better. That's how we look at it. Tomorrow we had heard that uh, the other number three was giving you guys some problems through training camp. What's it like uh, seeing him cut loose on, on the ACC's uh, secondaries there uh, with Addison? Uh, it's great to see him uh, finally get his chance uh, to you know play against someone else instead of us. Uh, and, and be excelling, you know. Um, once once I see him uh, at practice, you know, he, he was like the, the most like pure and for sure hands like I've, I've seen in a while, you know. And uh, I've, I've told him uh, that I think he's gonna be uh, ACC freshman All-American.